Yeah, I usually work with landscapes, but this time I've been so frustrated uh, with people that they can be so gullible and uh, I take things on the face value that <coughs> I started thinking about fables because fables uh, you can tell story uh, and compare animal behavior to people's behavior. Uh, so I reached for the fable. This is uh, my first in the series. It's called Happy Family and it's a mono, uh, monotype mm -hmm. and of course uh, I think we don't have to say too much about it. It's sheep. I call people who are gullible, who don't look past the first impression, uh, sheeple. Mm -hmm. And it's not my word, I heard it. Sheeple. <laughs> yeah. I heard it on the radio uh. and I like that, uh, that description of, you know, the word. Uh because some people really do be behave like sheeple and when you see people in a crowd they're like herd mm -hmm. <laughs> so I, I, that's why i don't like crowds really is this happy family two uh, which one is happy family one the uh the, the first one it didn't have enough colors mm -hmm. so i thought i would try again and mm -hmm. this second one came up better though this i call a luring sna snare Oh, snake. somebody. It's a snake. Yeah, but it should be snare. There's a mistake. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh. <I see. laughs> Greg. Uh -oh. <laughs> anyway, um, again, the f famous alluring with carrot, you know, pretending yeah. that you're something else than you are. Uh, and in, in the background is the true villain. <laughs> in this case, it's the wolf. Uh -huh. Uh, and the sheep, if you notice, has a tail, wolf's tail. So oh, it's a oh, I see, I see. Uh, sheep in the, uh, I mean, wolf in the sheep's clothes. Uh -huh. Okay, okay. This um, is helpless. helpless. And again, uh, people can be very angry at what is going on, but feeling that they can't do anything about it. It seems to be more like, uh, is it a, like more like a cattle than a sheep? It's more like a cattle at this time, yeah. 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 Cattle, bulls, <laughs> you uh, know, uh. yeah. But this one, the, the cattle can be angry also. But bulls can charge, eventually, <laughs> when you really push them. <laughs> if you get on their space. <laughs> yeah. This was really the last one. Mm -hmm. uh, again, and it's called into the shark jaws. Into the shark jaws. Um, and it's a. Uh, oh, again, people. Lips. Shop, shop, shop. Shop, shop, shop. Uh, the. The sheep going in there. Yeah. Uh, being allured by shopping, by thinking about the. Um, Things in life which are not really important mm. and leaving out uh, things which are important so that they sort of change their priorities. Mm. And of course those who drive the ideas uh, benefit. It's more like uh, there's that, uh, consumer rather than producer. That's right, or or creator. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, and this is called sheep herding, and as I said, uh, you know the when uh, crowd when you create or when you have a lot of people together, mm -hmm. something happens to individuals. They become part of that herd, mm -hmm. and it's uh, it becomes often unruly, mm -hmm. or it can be herded to, um, you know, push somewhere where they don't even want to go. 
and of course the the uh, horses. horses horses don't hurt the the sheep usually dogs are used for that but in this time I use horses they represent the Texas idea the Texas uh, cowboy, cowboy <laughs> you know and so I guess people will <laughs> see what it means yeah whip there and a pistol yeah in the bush era yeah yeah. Uh oh, and yeah, political there. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is all really political. <laughs> and this was my first try I, uh, because I was uh, painting before that. I wanted to try uh, my hand at monotype mm -hmm. before I uh, started the real monotypes. So this was the first. So one. this was the, yeah, this was the very loosely created with. Uh, oil colors. Hmm. The other ones are already printing inks, but this is oil colors and I wanted to see whether oil colors will, will work. Mm -hmm. They do. It's a little looser and I don't think I could have achieved the, uh, the results in the other ones using the oil colors, but it is possible to use them. So what uh, kind of inks are these? Those are regular printing inks. Printing inks. Mm -hmm. Yeah, these. I see also some uh, in the like in the background here. Uh, is that the effect from the? Well, as you because the, it it took several steps to create that. Mm -hmm. So by uh, running the the colors, you know and then running it through the press and then add another color running it through the press so sometimes you achieve because you have to remember where these previous shapes were mm -hmm. so sometimes the color may be introduced into area where the it has nothing should not be mm -hmm. so either you can erase it a little more or you know cover it up so that's in printmaking there is nothing sure. <laughs> you always run into some unexpected results. So from here, uh, you've done some new work. So what direction are you going now? Going to from well, this? well, this it's it, really not a new direction uh -huh. uh, because I've been re uh, trained as a printmaker and mm -hmm. a painter, mm -hmm. and um, I usually work with landscapes mm -hmm. but when I have an idea I need to express mm -hmm. I use figures mm -hmm. because I you know I'm drawing uh, regularly with figures it's good to practice mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, and uh, for my upcoming sh main, main show in the main gallery in, in January uh. next year uh, I'm also working with prints. Mm -hmm. It will be, they will be uh, monoprints, monotypes, mm -hmm. and I have also lithograph mm -hmm. vertically. Okay. Thank you. How about your uh, Polish your Polish background, right? The My background is uh, Czech. Oh, Czech. Sorry. So, and that's why <laughs> that's why I get. Uh, upset with people when they don't look deeper past the first plane because under communism on under the uh, totalitarian regime people need to go to look deeper because you are fed lies and you become aware that they are just lies at the front than the first uh, level la layer so, you know, we used to be able to read between lines, we call it. And so, you know, that's why I, it, I get frustrated with, uh, with public who perhaps didn't have this experience. Complacent. They are, yeah, 